Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, my name is Anna, and today it's, it's gonna be a fun video, it's more of an organizing kind of thing, so I kind of like those videos, and then it's just kind of fun to watch, but um, I thought I'd show what we we're gonna organize and all that fun stuff, so let's get going. So, this is what I have, I have these binders, and uh, binders, well I do have a binder right there, <laughs> But these are the writers that I'm going to be using to organize some fancy things. And then, this is my binder. This is going to be used for all my, um, for the upcoming series that I am having. So I thought I would just separate it from this binder. Because this binder is actually used just for in general. I actually don't have any other writers. I'm going to get that out. <laughs> I don't know why I keep that. But this is just like my general binder, story, idea, binder. So I thought I would just transform my current series to this binder. Just to be even neater. Because like my series is going to be a long one. And I don't want it to be mixed up with this. Because I'm constantly getting out my binder. I want to make sure that I'm writing what I'm writing is correct. So yeah, and here it's a big binder. Because one, it's a series. And I'm hoping it will be... Because I'm really hoping it'll be full. Because there's just like there is just a lot of lore and history and all that fun stuff in this new series. And some conspiracy theories, if you wanna call them that way. So I had to make sure that I get all my facts right. Guys, there are some things where I did it on purpose, but I'm gonna let you guys figure it out once it comes out. Which is not too soon on April 5th. I am revealing my book title on my Instagram, so head on over to Instagram, annikatie58, if you want to see what the title is. But yeah, so, with my binder, I also want a picture of my book cover as well. So I think I can get the dimension to work properly if I just have to measure out what is this. It's a 2 inch by 5 centimeter. okay. Yeah, I just have to figure out what the dimensions are and all that fun stuff. But yeah, I thought we would work on that, so let's get sorting it out. Sometimes I don't like to write on these because they smudge. They easily smudge, so I guess we have to see what we have. <laughs> but also, I bought everything from the dollar store because, yeah, it's cheaper for the most part. <laughs> This is actually the most expensive thing I bought from the dollar store, from this little haul, if you will, so. It's not a dollar anymore. I don't know why they keep calling it dollar store when it's not. Who knows? So I think I'll be using my green one for like the lore and like the history. I think I'm just gonna combine it together, just because in my head it makes more sense that way. And they seem a little bit similar. So, yeah. Ah, that's not even. No! Okay, crisis is done. <laughs> uh, which pen? I got these from Amazon, if you're wondering. So, they're really good. I really like these a lot. So, they don't bleed that much. And I just really like them that much. <laughs> so, we're gonna put lore. And then... History. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm just gonna speed this up.
I think I need to be like this. What do you guys think? <laughs> oh my gosh, I feel so bad for the little one. <laughs> Okay guys, so mine is completed, so let's go on over and see what we have. Well first off, I'm going to remove this plastic, because this is where my book cover is going to go. So this is what it looks like, it's just a plain old binder, which looks wonderful, so I do like it. Um, but yeah, if you want to know all my book cover reveal and all that stuff, head on over to my Instagram, annikitty58. Guys, it's coming soon. The book cover reveal is coming soon. But anyway, so this is... <laughs> okay, I'm pretending you never saw that. I'm gonna cut that part out. But this is what it looks like. We have all, all this stuff. So this is what my story is. And then I'm just gonna quickly flip through my stories. While I'm being on the side. Because you guys are not supposed to know yet. <laughs> I know, how could I? I just put them at the beginning because it just makes sense that way to me. So, they all might be seven bucks. Might. But yeah, so I'm starting from here. This this green one is like lore and history and all that. So anything about the world, like we got this random... Walnut McKinley, which is like a tourist attraction who ends up like people building a statue in the honor of him. It's just a random history <laughs> that I kind of just randomly thought about, so that's exciting. So, yeah, and these are just like um, some places as well. I should have not combined it on this Walnut McKinley, damn it, but that's okay. And then this is also just some um, history as well, which I'm not going to show you yet, but here's a little sneak peek if you want some stuff. And then, as I said, I really should remind this, but you can see that she has been well loved. But yeah, this is like all, also like all the places and all the stores that are taking place in my new book. It is a magical realism, so yeah, and this is just like the magic system and how it works and all that fun stuff. And just some additional information. We got currency. I should not have. I need to change. Okay, it's a good thing I'm writing it, but there's some things that should not be in here together. But yeah, so if you're interested, in my new world is based on. Geneva, all by Switzerland, so I'm excited. And then this is just some characters, like who they are, what they what they do, and how they look like. Um, 
which you cannot see and you definitely can't see the stories yet so I'm just gonna completely skip over that I'm sorry I'm like trying so hard not to ruin anything before it's time uh, my next one is just places so like we got losing places like Timball Hall or Ancient which is like a train station and we got Pokersville City it's just a city center where people do shopping so on so forth I still got more so yeah I know very creative nothing though but why not over right, here is just my creatures plant drinks I just decided to combine them all there's no point in separating it so I just like these made up creatures and creatures that are from the mythology itself I love reading mythology so yeah, and then honestly I did not think of it much about trees and plants or my shed. But that will come later. And then these are just made up drinks that I like to make up. And it just... Yeah, I really like permafrost. It sounds really interesting. But here's, here it is if you want to know what it is. Anyway, so over here is my spells and charms and like all those incantations. So I, I have some of their names, some of them don't, which is why they're blank. I just don't know what to call them. But some here we have reflected to you, and then we have barriers. So most of them are heavily, heavily borrowed from Latin. I love Latin. I think it's just, that, that's just a fascinating language. It's dead if you want to say that way but it's not really that because it's just been branched out so you know we got great Latin and all that and so yeah just some um, uh, incantations we got aquarius which is just water spell and an aquarius it's just a more powerful form of water but we also got matatio aquarius which is just a special change brightness you know things like that and then we got sports. We do have sports in this game or story. It's right now it's called Hypo Drive. Basically, it uses wind charm. But you need to use your wind charm to be able to fly. Um, but yeah, so this is the goalpost, and these are like the wind currents that you have to follow. So if you follow the wind currents, you should be able to go to the goalpost. If you do not, then you're like we can really get out of the game. So it's really important to follow the wind currents as how you see fit. So I just got a hyperdrive just because, you know, it has to do something with air. <laughs> but yeah, that's just my explanation. They have to catch a gale, which is like a ball. So all that fun stuff. Of course, you can cheat, but you will get disqualified. So maybe no cheat. <laughs> Over here is my currency, my fake currency exchange rate, which is really hard to think about because I keep changing stuff here and there. But I think I'm gonna go with this guy, just because to me it makes more sense. Oh, what's in my? Oh no, it's this one. I think I'm gonna go with this one. So let me know if this makes sense to you. This is all made up. Keep that in mind. But let me know if this like really makes sense. To me it does. But I don't know. <laughs> Just let me know. Because Dina is like the lowest one. I don't know if you saw that when I showed you at my places was it? Yes. It was at my place. Okay so here it is. So Currency and Dina is like the lowest currency. But I know, I really know, I hope you can see this. So, like, we got gold, which is the highest, and then we got Zubli, which is the, like the second lowest. It's actually not called Mubli for gold, but it is something. If you didn't remember what it was, it was Ethan. Ethan is the gold, so. Yeah, I, again, I have to rewrite it, so bear with me. I dinner is actually not made up. It's actually a real currency in some countries, European. But yeah, so this is my story, by officially, for my new 
series. I'm excited to start it. I just finished writing my chapter one, so I'm really excited to write my second book. I have yet to plan my third book. I didn't really get much done after that productive vlog that you guys saw, like way before this one, but yeah, I also got two, two more binders left over, which I'm going to use for something else if I think of any. But otherwise, it's so much better now. I don't have to worry about in this mess. Oh my gosh. It's so messy now. You got papers here, papers there, and there. But she will be safe in this binder. She's my baby right now. <laughs> but anyways, I hope you guys like this um uh, I was about to say, I hope you guys like this story. <laughs> I hope you do anyway. I hope you guys like this video. Uh, let me know if you guys want to see more of these or more like behind the scenes kind of thing. But um, otherwise, uh, please like, comment, subscribe so you'll be notified every time you post. And I will see you on my next one. Bye!